All right, sidewalk stimulation. Let's see what would happen if I didn't have the edge guard. <sighs> Ooh, that would have been bad. Luckily, I have these edge guards now. Even with the door guard right there, it's cringy. But look at this, super smooth. Hey guys, go Christian. Make more videos again today, guys. We're gonna be taking a look at a door guard edge trim for your vehicle. So without further ado, let's get to it. So here's the actual product itself. Really simple. I mean, all it is is actually just putting this on the door. And this is all obviously plug and play. Let's unbox this bad boy. Ooh. Some literature right here. I mean, it's so simple. The thing what I liked about this one is the fact that it's actually really pliable and bendable, so it can get on those curves. And that's what I want to test out to see if it works. Ooh, if to see if it works. But man, really nice piece. I'm liking how you know stretchy and pliable it is. However, it's still really tough. I like it. If this is on your door, your edges are definitely protected from any dings or scrapes and stuff like that. Okay, so it seems like it's one continuous long piece right here. So in terms of unboxing, nothing too crazy. Let's actually install this bad boy. Okay, I have the Nissan Versa parked in a weird angle in here just so that you guys can see exactly what's going on. I've already done the front door and I'm going to tell you right now before I even start in the second door and show you how exactly this goes on that this was awesome. It worked flawlessly. Without the actual edge guard, you can hit something. There's a chance that damage can't happen right here because of hitting another vehicle. However, in this situation, no chance whatsoever, guys. Look at this. Let's put the camera down and show you how I actually do it on this side. You are going to need three tools right here. You're going to need some scissors to cut the end, a mallet or, some, you know, small hammer and also some pliers and I'll show you what I do with the pliers in a second and I didn't even measure this out I just basically started putting it on the edge right here and you can see I'm doing it first with my hand and literally just it just goes in you know they really did measure this out because it goes on really well Okay, so once you're done with the bottom like so, with your hand, you just take your mallet or hammer and just basically hammer it in And just like that, you are done with the bottom. You can't even tell it's there. This is awesome. It's really important to use it on the bottom right here. The reason being is because on sidewalks and stuff, sometimes when you open a door, yeah, you're cleared from the sidewalk. However, when you open a door, it, it scrapes the vehicle like so. So this actually will help in terms of not damaging your vehicle on the sidewalk. I have actually a huge gash from my friend opening a door on the sidewalk and it just damaged this entire bottom part right here. However, with this, you're good to go. So now you're probably asking, what about the edge right here? Bam, look at that. Just curves straight into the edge, nice and easily. And then obviously I'm just gonna use a hammer. Just get straight in there, guys. So let me continue going up. And at the top right here, I'm just gonna take my snips, make sure it's good. Bam, cut it off. You might see some metal piece in here. Make sure you take it out as well. In my situation, there was none. Hammer that in place and you're done. If you see a metal piece like this, this is to keep it rigid. Make sure you just basically use some pliers and pull it out. As you can see, it's really simple and then you can start working on it. And that's what you need the pliers for. Okay, now let's close the door and let's see how it looks. Okay, so this is the side that is done and you can clearly see the black right there for the actual edge guard and you can't see the bottom one because it kind of blends in. However, it doesn't look too bad compared to the other side. I thought it was gonna look worse, but as you can see, this is how it looks on the other side right here. In my situation, I do know that I want this for my sister's car to make sure that if she opens the door, it doesn't get damaged or anything on her car as well as anyone else's vehicle. Now, you can get different colors, okay? You don't have to stick with black. You can get white and stuff. If you have a white car, get a white one. If you have a black car, get the black one and it will blend in a lot more. So I'm gonna put it on the other side and show you how it looks in the end. Okay, and it's done. Look at that. It took me literally 10 minutes to do the entire thing because it's so simple. Plug and play. You guys already know it. And now you have protection from the side of your door from hitting cars and or the sidewalk right there. It looks great and it also protects the vehicle. That's the two things that I wanted to see. And it's going to give it great protection on the edges. So definitely a thumbs up in my book. Easy install. And I'm loving it, guys. I'm absolutely loving this. 
<laughs> Alrighty guys, now it's time for your favorite time, rating time. In terms of pliability, the fact that this can bend in any corner pretty much, even a 90 degree angle like I did, toughness, ease of install, you know, plug and play, no glue, no mess, just, just push her in there, use a mallet and put it in. And also a bonus, which is noise reduction. I gotta give this product a solid 10 out of 10. Like what, 10 out of 10? Clinchers, you haven't given 10 out of 10 in a long time, probably ever. And that's true, I normally make sure, you know, to keep the 10 out of 10 for a product that's absolutely hits all its marks on what it does and how it delivers and it's so simple and the protection is there that i had to give it a 10 out of 10. this is hands down the best edge guard i've ever seen and i've ever used so i'm absolutely loving this and i know you will love it all right guys that's mission for the video hope you guys enjoyed it links to purchase everything is going to be in the description section below you guys already know it now your doors are protected from paint chips and also it doesn't look bad at the same time but you guys already know it if you like this video make sure you smash that like button other than that guys keep just here saying thanks for watching it peace